Hey guys, welcome back to No Catch Your Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Wednesday, so it's what you're working on Wednesday. <laughs> so today I'm working on a new whip that uh, you guys haven't seen before. I bought some yarn on clearance at Joann's a few months ago. I can't remember. It was in the summer. But I bought some um, five balls of Lion Brand jeans in the colorway uh, Faded. And this is pretty light blue with like white marble deanness in there. <laughs> Each ball is, it's worsted weight and it's 246 yards. So I have just over 1,200 yards of it. And uh, I've had it in my stash for a little while since I bought it. Uh, wondering what to make with it. So I decided to hop on the bandwagon to, uh, with everybody else about the pocket shawls. <laughs> and I wanted to support a, another crocheter, you know, in the community here. So I went and I bought Pamela's from a Pamela's Adoring Crochet, uh, her pocket shawl. She has a free tutorial for it on her YouTube channel, which will be linked below. But I'll also link the PDF pattern uh, page <laughs> for it. It was only $1.99, so it's super cheap, and it helps support another creator. So I'll link the free video if you're a video person, but I'm not a video person. I prefer to read a pattern. And then I'll also link the written one. Anyways, <laughs> I'll link the video tutorial and the paid-for PDF below if you're interested in checking out either of those. And also her, her channel along with the video. But anyways, here's mine. I got a whole ball in it so far and I've started the second ball. I'm probably like a third of the way into the second ball. So here's <laughs> the pattern. And it's really long because it's a shawl. So I'm, I'm in, kind of in the middle of it. Not really. But it's, you know, it's a big old long shawl. <laughs> it's very squishy. I really like this, um, this jeans yarn. I've never used it before. And that's why I bought it when it was on clearance because I wanted to just try it out. And it's really pretty. There's the pattern. It's got kind of like a mesh in the middle of it. So I'm probably about halfway done with the width of the shawl. Um, maybe a little bit more than half. I don't know. <laughs> but I'm doing some repeats. And then I'm going to do another like border edge, I guess, on this side. And then I'll do the pockets. And she does have fringe on hers. I don't know if I'll add the fringe yet. It really depends on if I have enough yarn. And I might ask my mom if she wants it because I'm probably going to give this to my mom. And if she wants the fringe, then I'll stick it on there. But it's coming out really pretty. And it's a very easy pattern. It's simple. Uh, I'm in the repeat part right now, and it's three rows repeated over and over. Uh, seven times, I think. So uh, I got those memorized. I just have to keep uh, track of which row I'm on so I don't lose my number of repeats. But, um, yeah, I think I'm liking it a lot. I really like this yarn, too, because it's super squishy and soft. And uh, I can't wait to finish it and share it with you guys. But this is what I'm working on today. I was literally working on it. I was talking to Devin. I was waiting to record, but I was talking to him. He was on lunch break. And uh, so I was sitting here crocheting on it while doing that. But I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to hop off here and go work on it some more. I'm going to try to get it done before the next No Catch Name episode because it's, it's flying by really fast. So let me know in the comments below what you guys are working on this week. And uh, feel free to leave links or anything like that to shops or specific patterns or video tutorials or channels, whichever. <laughs> Just leave them in the description for all of, I mean, not the description, the comments, so that we can all check them out. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in another video. Bye, guys.